On the previous episode of Road to Doll of Legion Zane, we had gotten ourselves a few more items, including a band of Sidorak that has a anointment on it. It's not the right anointment that we want, but it'll do in a pinch. I don't think we really got much of anything on the last episode. We really need to grind out some good stuff on this one. Here's my build in case you guys want to see that. We'll include that for those of you guys watching that want to try and emulate this build. And uh, there's Guardian Rank in case you care about that. So today we're going to farm for a few things. We're going to start by uh, going after a Star Helix that is shock damage. I don't even care if it's anointed. If it does shock damage, then we're taking it. As you can see, the Star Helix is absolutely destroying. With the 100% Sentinel Cryo Anointment on Zane, this thing will wreck face. All right, so we're going to go try and get a shock one. And also today we're going to try and get a warlord from Billy. We're going to try and get a 100% cryo sentinel Nighthawken. Yeah, good luck with that. We're also going to do some proving grounds runs. We're going to try and get Wotan. I don't want a surge. I don't want a vanquisher. I don't want a thunderball fist. I don't want a hyper focus. I only want one thing and it's flipping disgusting, bro. Damn, bros, we got a four legendary drop and probably nothing we can use. Yep. Yep. And a yep. <laughs> Jack Tracker. Not going to tell you guys that was my nickname in high school because it wasn't. So for all you people that have been asking uh, for the Jolts Dude co-op, uh, it'll happen. Just not not soon. Wow, that's a really, really good Destructo Spinner for Zane. Too bad I'm on a Doll Allegiance. Attack Command Lifesteal. This would be really good on Flak, though. Except it's not. It doesn't have a uh, an element. Put the Dipsy Doo on me, man. I'm just going to zip across the map and explode. Do it. Zoom! <laughs> and he dropped a freaking skin. Sure, why not? Got a Legendary here. Flood. Very active Flood. Nice. What you got, man? What you got? What the flip? What the hell, man? This Torg Allegiance is going great, guys. <laughs> this new Torg Allegiance that I just started is going off to a really hot start here. Camel Strike redeemed no glasses for two minutes. Okay, no glasses. This could get ugly. Like me. Haha, <laughs> without glasses. I don't know. You guys think that I look uh, cuter without glasses or with the glasses? I don't know. You tell me. Let me know in the comment section down below. This guy's dead, right? Okay, yeah. <laughs> All right, listen, guy. My bear is about to run out. I need you to be dead. I can tell that. I can see that yellow bar. Oh, yeah. We, we out of barriers. What we got? Um, bro, that's... It's not in your loot pool. <laughs> I had to really, like, look and make sure that was the, uh, the duke. If you get any 100% cryo hyper focus that you won't use, been farming them and haven't had much luck. Yeah, I will send it your way, dude. Well, too bad I'm not doing a digi clone build. Imagine if I could like hit my shots on a consistent basis. What we got here? Yo, yo, hold up. Harf Mill literally just asked me to find this thing and it just now dropped. <laughs> Harf Mill was like, yo, if you find 100% cryo sentinel, <laughs> That is a donk donk moment right there. Whiskey Tango. Uh, <laughs> why is the game trolling me? Why is it gotta troll me? Getting lots of legendaries though, man. Jeez. Another destructive spinner and a thunder pump. <laughs> He flipped over the barrier. That was adorable. <laughs> we got five legendaries on that run. None are good with my build. And Surge, Surge, Destructo Spinner, and a freaking Surge. You suck. Huh. Cool. Okay. You know what? I am going to take this, but it's not anointed, and that sucks. Thank you, game. Thank you. That took forever to get that thing. It's not max damage. I don't care. It doesn't need to be max damage. I'm Zane, dude. I'm Zane. The damage is going to be fine. 
Ladies, gentlemen, boys and girls, cats wearing birthday hats, and people that are pooping on my couch. It is day number 10 of the Road to Doll Legion Zane, and I need a new name. What do you got for me? Yeah, I like Dolphin, dude. I like Dolphin. So we're going to go with Dolphin. Dolphin. That's, that's the sound that would be really cool there. Hey guys, why am I upside down? Guys, where did my body go? Hey, we got a legendary in this one, chat. A rough rider. Wow. All right, guys. How many runs do you guys think it'll take to get the night auken? I predict a million. A million and six. 42 runs. I would be content with 42 runs, believe it or not. I would. I would be content with 42 runs. Uh-huh. Yep. Uh-huh. Yep. <laughs> Double monocles. Cool. Get out of the way. I'm trying to look at this. Okay, cool. Wow. Double drop. Loaded dice and a monocle. Did you drop a Polybius? Is that a Polybius? That is a Polybius. Why are you dropping Polybius, man? All right, what you got for me, dude? Ah, it's not a burst fire one either. Freaking Hellwalker. Wow. Well, hello. Son of a mother. Whoa, he dropped two Nighthawkins. One demo skagging dropped two nine Hawkins, and neither one of them had the anoint that I wanted. Of course, he dropped two things. What the hell is happening here? He dropped a. Come on, man. We got three nine Hawkins on that run and still didn't get the anointment that we want. Huh. All right, let's put this on with 100% damage because my action skill just ended. Look at that slow ass projectile, man. Even, oh my God, just get out of my inventory and just stay there on the ground. Think about what you've done. Come on, baby. That's not a night hawk and come on. I cannot believe it. I might, I cried a little bit. <laughs> I cried a little bit. That was a really exciting moment for me there. Oh my God. I cannot believe we got it. I honestly didn't think that we were going to get that to drop at all. Let's do Proven Grounds because going to Proven Grounds, who knows? Maybe we'll end up getting something doing that before we do the takedown. You guys ready for this? <laughs> He's like, this is bullcrap. He's cheating. Did he say he never took up pasting? What? Wow. Wow. Look at the doll stats on that. You freaking turd. Wow. <laughs> that Torg Allegiance, though. Am I right, guys? <laughs> I was Power Jacker. Power Jacker's really going to work. You know what I'm saying? Power Jacker's like... Mm. Damn, Power Jacker, work it. There we go. Finally. While barrier is active, status effect chance on a non-elemental. <sighs> that is an engorged rack, AKA a chubby rack. He's gots to die, man. He's gots to die. I'm not gonna get anything out of him, but that was a Mr. President rack. Did you see that? He just threw himself right in front of those bullets and died another one gee whiz so these guys are essentially chubby rack but they generally only drop you money and uh then they drop eggs on your face ride the roller coaster guys you guys ever ride the roller coaster before we ride the roller coaster let's see if it's worth it no legendaries so i'm gonna go out on a limb and say not really worth it Ooh, ho, ho, ho. I'm too okay. And you're too dead. <laughs> All right. Cool. Got you guys a legendary. Or two. Got you two legendaries. Wow. A baby maker and a gunnerang. Chat, you're so welcome. 
Chat, is this not your luckiest day of your life? Chat, tell me this isn't the best day of your life right here. Right here, right now. You got to be here when this happened. Light. Another legendary for you guys. Yes. Perhaps it will unravel next oh, day. hello. I'll take that for me, man. I need that for my playthrough. Not a good anointment for me, but sure. All right, this should be nothing but legendaries, right? Since we've got all the check marks. Not a single legendary? Wait, let me let me get a closer look at this. Yep, those are those. There's a check mark beside all. I want check. Yep, check, 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 check. Oh, that's right. I was supposed to get no check marks. That way, I could get some legendaries for you guys. What was I thinking? Getting all the check marks. Of course, we got two legendaries. Makes sense. The guy in the chair sucks. It's true. You swallow though. We got a Quasar not anointed. A breeder. Splash damage action skill in. Double penetrating breeder. That would be the one. We got four legendaries. We got four legendaries when we didn't get all the check marks. Nobody likes you anointed militants. So you know, nobody likes you. Drop. Oh, cool. Thanks for that. Okay, what we'll we got over here? Another Lucian's Call? Wow. Okay, that's a good one. Whew. Which Proven Grounds is this? I think it's called Proven Grounds. This one sucks. I think, that's, I think that's how it's listed. So, our reward for getting through the Trial of Fervor was that the boss dropped us a black hole. Beautiful. Wow, double legendary drop. One of these two is going to be his dedicated drop, right? Uh, non anointed phasor and a boom infiltrate. Damn! <laughs> I give up trying to figure this thing out, man. I give up trying to figure this thing out. We got a non anointed wagon wheel, got a jackhammer action skill in, a super ball, and a unforgiven with the 340 crit damage, which is not ideal, but some options for you at least, right? Now we can just go straight to the raid. Look at that. <laughs> that star helix just melts them. Once you get past their uh, shield. Oh, crap. Oh, 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 man, that was scary. Okay, that did work. There we go. Look at that. <laughs> we got this. All takedown done. The gear we were using, I uh, didn't really even use the MP5. I was going to use that for speed to get out of bad situations. Didn't really need it. Uh, we used the Shock Star Helix, which you can farm from the Power Troopers to uh, break his shields. We used the Breath of the Dying to take out the Brain. Once he split to the top and bottom half, use this on the Brain uh, after you bust the, the base shield part with the Star Helix. And that does massive damage. We use the uh, Arctic Star Helix with 100% Cryo Sentinel to bust up the legs and also take out anything that had a uh, a armor bar on it because this just absolutely melts them. We had a run and gun band of Sidorak. This would give us a lot of movement speed. And then on action skill end, uh, we had damage reduction. So that was pretty nice. We had a Sea and Dead with plus four to Donnie Brook. This also had Doll Weapon Damage, which was extremely helpful. It also gave us some shock resistance as well. Uh, Icebreaker Victory Rush, which gave us bonus damage when anything was frozen. So if you froze something, you were pretty much guaranteed to destroy it. Plus, you would get 18% movement speed and damage for 60 seconds after killing a badass. And when you're on Mayhem 4, there's a lot of badasses, so really good. That actually doesn't apply to Wotan, but it wasn't like we were going to uh, kill him, then you know use that to kill a bunch of stuff anyhow. Then we uh, let our drone go around dropping the piss grenade on things uh, because that gave us a uh, weapon, grenade, and action skill damage increased by 25 seconds for every six seconds that it did that. Plus uh, the piss grenade when it hits enemies, those enemies take an extra 20% damage for six seconds as well. So very, very helpful. Uh, here's the final build. We went with uh, Barrier and Drone. Mostly uh, the Drone does the, the lion's share of the work here. We went the uh, the Cryo Anointment or the uh, Cryo Augment and the uh, the Bad Dose Augment. 
Uh, you can swap the bad dose to static field if you're having issues with shields. But since we're using the uh, the Bandit Sidorak, we never have to worry about our shields at all. So that's why we uh, went with bad dose. Anyhow, because this one also increases your movement speed and your fire rate. So anybody that tells you to use uh, static field on Zane, eh, eh, wouldn't disagree. <laughs> but a couple points in good misfortune, this combined with the Sea and Dead class mod allowed us to uh, keep our action skill up pretty much nonstop. Uh, salvation kept uh, healing us this uh, death falls close gave us lots of bonuses i don't max these things out because the extra uh, the extra shots aren't really that crucial you're going to be firing off a lot of shots anyhow what's really crucial are maxing out these two skills at the top here uh, those combined with this equals a lot of speed and a lot of damage and then over here, uh, the the lion's share of the damage that you get from this build comes from these two skills here. So they're really good. If you can, also make sure you put a point in confident confidence with this build. Uh, brain freeze is what allows us to freeze things. And then ready for action gave us our shield back even faster um, than before. So really, really fun playthrough. I had a lot of fun. Uh, Doll Legion Zane was a blast. Uh, I could not have picked a better allegiance to start things with, honestly. One of the best times doing this playthrough, man. Uh, it, it was it was a fun, nice challenge, and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed putting it on for you guys. I will put the save file in the uh, the description of the video. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Y'all have a great day.